Okay, today I will be showing you how to set up your PlayStation 5 with your Elgato 4K60 Pro. This is the MK2. Um, it says you can do 4K pass-through, a uh, 4K capture actually, and 240Hz pass-through. So if you have that nice 120Hz refresh TV, you'll be able to take advantage of the PlayStation's full graphical capabilities. All right, chat, so I already have mine installed, and if you are not a computer person, I recommend you do not try to do this yourself. It's not hard, but if you don't know computers and you don't know how to do stuff, plug stuff in, I would not recommend it. But as you can see, this is my graphic card, my RAM, my fans, my CPU, everything, memory over there. This thing right here, the Gigabyte, that is my graphics card. If you look under it, you can see this Elgato. That is the captured card. I just plugged it into, as you can see, those little lines underneath the shiny battery. That is called the PCI Express slot. And I just plugged it into one of those. I have it mounted in. And as you can see, if we get, if we put the computer back, oh, if we look at the back of it now, right here we have the Elgato in and out. So basically you take your HDMI, from your PlayStation. I just did the HD60S video. Hopefully this one is a little bit better. It's looking like it's gonna start off the same way. But we take the HDMI from the PlayStation, this is it, and we plug it in here to the end. And then we take the out, which is gonna be where our monitor goes. Give me a second, gotta get it. Ooh. Boom, this is plugged into the back of my monitor. We plug that to the out. So basically in means we want the signal coming in and out means where are we sending the signal out to. So I will push my computer back. It's plugged in, PlayStation's right there. Look, got kind of nice. We got the 4K60 Pro, you know. Woo, I'm getting dizzy, okay, let me stop. Everything's plugged in and now we head back over here to the super duper scuffed stream plays and I'm gonna switch over to the screen. All right, chat, so phone to the screen in the computer now. So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna open up Google Chrome. I'm already on their website. Uh, we're gonna go to Elgato's website and we're gonna click this downloads up here. What we wanna do Okay, so what we wanna do is this is the 4K 60 the s the pro 4k 60 pro what we want is the 4k do that we're gonna download boom it pops up down there boom bang bow we're gonna wait for it we're gonna open it up and we're gonna do our thing drag this over here to this monitor so you guys can see what we want to do is oh well i guess because mine is okay so i'm gonna have to remove it. we'll remove it real quick on my computer and then we'll re-download it so i'll be back when that happens all right i'm back now finally when i click this like a normal person it will open up such as so wow wow i can't believe it took like 20 minutes because we got it plugged in and everything it's already ready to go so as you can see it says source uh 2160 p by 59 uh, it's basically 4k 60 fps um it says capture though, so if you come in here, you go to general, you change the format. You want. Well, let me change the format. Using our. As you can see, I have three different Elgados, but we are using the 4K60 right now. Uh, all this stuff, I don't know about all this. This just depends on like your color range. If you want uh, expanded more color, shrink less. I don't know what this means, and this means something else that I don't really know. Um, recording, uh, this is what you want, capture, recording, enable HDR recording if you have the space on your computer, the memory, all that to do it, um, but you know, I always record at the highest bit rate, so the best produce so you know your computer can do better flashback recording i only do 30 minutes because the more you do the more st space is going to take up but yeah. uh, microphone you can set your default microphone as you can tell it can see when i'm talking and when i stop it stops stuff like that i don't know why it won't let me change that to start a flashback recording for some reason it won't let me change that to Usually you would be able to change this. Currently running a newsletter. 
Yeah, for some reason it's not working on mine, but yeah, as you can see, we have this open on here. I'll scale this. I am not, I do not have my monitor on. I am playing through the capture card, right? There's a little bit of a delay, but like, I mean, I could go start up a memory. I did the key jungle. Go to SSD. Okay. No loading screen. One of the great things about PS5, and boom, look at that. So as you can see, this is off of this app. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna close this, and like most of you guys will be doing, you guys will be using OBS. So I'm gonna get ready and open OBS. Drag my OBS. Okay. So as you can see, this is a normal OBS. This is how most people's OBS looks. So stuff like that. Good. So. Oh yes, boom, well, you can see all my other scenes, but we're gonna make a new scene starting fresh for y'all. So the first source you wanna do, you wanna do a video capture device. I already have it on here. I'm gonna be adding the 4K60 Pro, which is our capture card. Properties to make sure everything is the right thing. 4K capture, we're gonna turn it on, activate it. Boom, as you can see, it is a little uh, too big, but even when you zoom in, the game still looks great because it's. 4k and then transform it to screen to quickly do that and then boom this looks way better to play so i can't hear oh wait you guys can't hear it either so that's another setting we must change we'll go to properties yours will be on device default me i change mine to custom once again the reason i do that is because we want it to run at 4k at 60 fps constantly uh everything else doesn't matter and it should be capturing audio i usually do output audio because i have my headphones plugged into my computer and i usually want to be able to hear so me i'm gonna change that back for me but you guys are free to do whatever you want if you do on capture audio only basically you won't hear it through your computer the stream and your recordings will hear it though and um if you do output desktop audio, we'll get this isn't outputting right audio. We'll get desktop audio should be captured on speakers. It, and I still can't hear it for some reason. I don't know why. Oh, because I have to have it on. Yeah, I'm messing stuff up. Oh, shoot. Anyways, whatever. As you can see, I got it plugged in. As far as audio, though, I really want to... You can hear the controller is doing this thing, but if you plug your headphones into the controller, you will no longer have audio for your chat because it basically switches from HDMI to analog, which is the controller. So... Basically, when you have your PS5 hooked up to the 4K, there is no having your headphones plugged in. You have to literally play, you have to listen to your game audio through your PlayStation. Now, if you have the Astro A40s or A50s, this is something totally different for you. You guys have a cord, the optical cable, and an adapter for the PS5 to make everything smooth and fluent for you. As far as everybody else, this equipment is not available. Um, the 4K60 does not offer an audio port to put the party link as like you have the HD60S or 60S Plus. So that's another reason why some people prefer to buy that. But if you're a content creator, I definitely recommend this because this is just pure. I mean, this is this is just OBS for one. Let me let me get out of here. Really like YouTube and like that's your main focus. You're gonna be loving this 4K capture YouTube. It's literally, when I say you can capture and do everything, it's going to look the best like possible. It's going to look the best possible. So as you can see, I'm not even playing. I'm just playing through. Oh. Oh, shoot. Okay. Look at, look at me go. Oh, got to avoid that. There's a lot of stuff going on, sir. A nice little book it. Look at that land, nice and soft, and this is playing through the utility. Like I'm not even on the monitor, so as you guys can hear everything through here. OBS, I don't know why it does it. I don't use OBS. I'm just using that to show you guys how to initially set it up. 
I use Streamlabs, as you can see, I am recording this video, it is right here now, making multiple millions of copies, so yeah. But yeah, hopefully this video helped you guys out, um, hopefully you guys are enjoying your PS5, shout out to everybody that got one, and also make sure you guys, if you guys have not gotten one yet, and you guys want a better chance of getting one, follow me on Twitter, hop in my Discord, links will be down in the description below, but man, I have so many notification bots i don't have bots to purchase i just have bots that will notify you hey walmart just went up go get it playstation go get it go get playstation go get it you want playstation go get it and chat wow i'm so pissed that that why did nobody tell me my camera froze my camera's been frozen the whole video chat I kind of want to redo the whole video, but I kind of don't because y'all can get the point. Y'all see it when it's... Oh, that's crappy. Whatever, chat. Y'all get the point. Anyways, make sure if you don't have a PS5, you hit me up on Twitter. Follow me. I retweet this stuff. I got bots in my Discord. They automatically get notified. Everybody that's in the server, if you want to know, hey, Xbox in the stock, hey, PlayStation, oh, 3080, oh, 3070, oh, 3090, you know, oh, RX7, or I mean, uh, 6900X, you know, what? we get all the good notifications, so make sure you guys do me a favor. Make sure you guys also drop a like for me. Like I said, I don't do YouTube videos often, so. Hopefully, you know, I'm able to help some people out. And if you have any questions, hit them up in the comments below. And I will be answering them and getting back to you guys. And uh, make sure you guys just come follow me on Facebook and come hang out with me. We game, play Apex. We're going to be playing a bunch of... I think I'm going to buy Spider-Man. I need to finish The Last of Us. I really love playing God of War. And it looks so good in 4K. So I think I'm going to do a whole new playthrough of that. And, uh, yeah. So, other than that, I'm out of here. Hopefully, uh... You guys appreciate this video. Hopefully you guys are able to learn something. Hopefully I was able to help you. Hopefully I was able to, you know, give you some content, some insight. And hopefully you guys had a good day and uh, all that other good stuff. I don't know why this is turning into, it's the music. It's getting to me. It's so soft. It's so warming. I feel like I need to be giving an inspirational speech right now. Like, you can do anything you can if you put your mind to it. You just got to stop. I mean, you just got to not stop. That's the thing. A lot of people like to stop. But when you stop, that's when you don't, that's when you give up. When you give up, you can't achieve your goals anymore. You got to be able to keep going. You got to have that ability to not stop you got to have the willing and the motivation to keep going to push through everything all the obstacles that may be in your way you know you got to be able to overcome all of that crazy how this was supposed to be a ps5 setup video i'm out